Well, local businesses continue to show their support for Ukraine, sometimes through food and sometimes through dance. News 4's Sarah Minkowitz stopped by several places today helping to raise money for the war-torn country. Sarah. Jackie, one of the businesses I stopped by today is the Fred Astaire Dance Studio in Williamsville. They're using the art of dance as both a healing method and a way to give back. Dancing, it's our remedy, it's our relief, it's a something which is pull us out of the, the dark state of mind. The war in Ukraine hits home for the owners and instructors at the Fred Astaire Dance Studio. Oh, very bad war in Ukraine and we have in our staff four people from Ukraine, including me and my husband, and we have two teachers from Ukraine. It's been a difficult time for them, knowing their loved ones in Ukraine face danger every day. All my family in Ukraine, mother, father, my brother, my grandparents, everybody, and of course my heart completely there. So physically here, but my mind, my everything is there. The studio wanted to do what they can to help. That's why a portion of the ticket sales in their upcoming showcase will go toward raising money for humanitarian efforts in Ukraine. Just in the light of recent events, I mean, it's a big tragedy for Ukrainian people and the whole world, I believe. The support for Ukraine from local businesses continues at Debella's on Niagara Falls Boulevard. Customers are given the option to round up their total and donate to help feed Ukrainians. Even though Ukraine is far away, it still feels like you see the communities there being impacted and we want to be able to help any way we can. So this is the small part that we can do to help. Now, Fred Astaire's showcase is this Sunday at 2 p.m. at the Buffalo Marriott in Amherst. We'll have the ticket info on our website at WIVB.com. In the studio, Sarah Mikowitz, News 4.